Hi, I am presenting our work on attention guided image compression by deep reconstruction of compressive sensed saliency skeleton. In this paper, we propose a deep learning system for attention guided dual layer image compression, AGDL. ROI compression is to exploit a well known property of human vision a viewer's attention is not evenly distributed in all parts of an image. Instead, our attentions focus on one or few regions of greater interest than the rest of the image, which pertain to salient foreground objects. Background regions are delegated to our peripheral vision and hence have much lesser acuity. Playing this tapering of visual acuity away from ROIs, a ROI image compression method allocates a much lower bit budget to encode pixels outside of ROIs than those inside, and saves a significant number of bits without materially sacrificing visual quality of compressed images. In existing ROI image compression methods, an extra bit budget is allocated to ROI and it is shared equally by all pixels in ROI. But on a second reflection, we should be more discriminating than ROI and spend extra bits only on pixels that can contribute to perceptual quality after being refined. Instead of a contiguous region of interest, we introduce a much sparser representation called saliency sketch to highlight semantically significant structures within ROI. One step further, we define a so-called critical pixel set that is the intersection of the saliency sketch and the set of pixels that have large reconstruction errors. The critical pixel set specifies a skeletal sub-image that needs to be further sampled and refined. For the saliency-driven refinement task, we take a more proactive approach than the straightforward CNN removal of compression artifacts. Here we introduce the design of the proposed AGDL image compression system, and two key technical contributions, 1. Detecting saliency sketch and critical pixel set from the compressed base layer image, 2. Refining the base layer image with the CS measurements of the critical pixel set. AGDL consists of a two-stage encoder and a joint decoder. Given an image to be compressed, AGDL first encodes it to a base layer using a traditional image compressor, and then predicts the critical pixel mask from the base layer using a deep neural network. The resulting critical pixel mask is used to extract the set of critical pixels. After that, AGDL system performs compressive sensing on the detected critical pixel set and transmits the CS measurements along with the base layer. The decoder takes the base layer and the CS measurements of the critical pixel set as input to produce a refined image with highlighted semantic structures by a restoration network and a CS refining module. The architecture of the proposed prediction network is revised from BossNet, a network designed for salient object detection. As shown, the prediction network is a UNET-like encoder-decoder network which learns to predict critical pixel mask from base layer image. We design the critical pixel mask prediction network as an encoder-decoder architecture because it is able to capture high-level global contexts and low-level details at the same time. The most important and technically involved component of the AGDL image compression system is its CNN decoder. The task of AGDL decoding is to refine the JPEG-coded base layer aided by the CS-coded side information on saliency skeleton. Specifically, the AGDL decoder receives the base layer and refinement layer, and then jointly decodes the two layers to produce a refined image which strictly satisfies the CS constraints. In essence, the AGDL decoder is a heavy-duty CNN that removes the compression artifacts of the base layer image with encoder-supplied strong priors on ROI. In the design of the restoration network, we adopt a dual domain, pixel domain and transform domain network to take full advantage of redundancies in both pixel and transform domains. Here, we present rate distortion curves of ROI. The rate is calculated by bits consumed to encode the entire image averaged per pixel, and the distortion is measured by the PSNR of the ROI area. For AGDL, the rate is the sum of the bits consumed by the JPEG-coded base layer and the CS-coded side information. We can see that the proposed AGDL compression system outperforms all the competing methods by a large margin, on both portrait images and general object images. We also present the visual comparisons of different methods. We can see that the AGDL compression system can preserve structure features better than the state-of-the-art GAC method and J2K ROI compression. Next, please enjoy the visual comparisons.